COVID cases rising, hospitalizations soaring, the dangerous Delta variant to blame. I, I can't believe we're going through this again. Bevan Strickland is preparing for what may come. She's a nurse anesthetist at High Point Medical Center. I really thought this was it. We were, you know, it wasn't done, but we were, we weren't going to have another wave. A COVID wave she doesn't want to repeat, especially after spending six weeks volunteering in the epicenter of the COVID outbreak in New York City. It was so extreme. It was like walking from normal life into a nightmare. A nightmare faced with uncertainty. She treated the sickest patients at the Mount Sinai Hospital in Queens. If you're just sick and suffering and you have to be taken care of in a hospital and there's not enough room and there's not enough people, it's bad. The faces of COVID patients still fresh in her mind. Patients taking their last breath on stretchers in the hallways, unable to be in comfort, unable to say goodbye to their loved ones. I don't have to know these people or their lives, but everybody is better than that. You know, they no one deserves to be sick and disoriented and scared and then laying in their own wetness. Now here in High Point, she's starting to see more COVID patients come through the operating room, many who are under 55. Younger people who have were sick with COVID in the ICU and they actually have all of these complications from being sick. A sickness she says may be prevented with a shot and wearing a mask. I think that's what's affecting people. I think that's why we're starting to people see people mask up again and get caught, you know, cautious. Cautious to protect yourself and others from the virus. If it happened once, it can happen again. And that this is what that should be teaching all of us, you know, forever. We shouldn't forget this.